right? Go oh, yeah, you got it out. All right, Amos 8 and 11. Behold, the days come, saith the Lord Power, that I will send a famine in the land. Yep. Not a famine of bread, mm -hmm. nor a thirst for water, but of hearing the words of the Lord. Right, because hey, there's going to be a lot of turmoil and shit going on too, man, because that shit going to get ramped up as well. Yep. And that's when people going to start real, because the Lord going to put the spirit on them. The Lord said he's going to pour his, his, his spirit upon, uh, upon all flesh, man. So he's going to pour his spirit upon all the all these people upon the earth, and they're going to realize that we were the, what we, we those wise men, all right? They're going to realize that we had the truth, all right? And then they're going to be seeking and searching for us, man. But because of this net neutrality and this, this goddamn uh, new world order that these devils, these so-called white people is trying to implement, man, all right? That ain't because that, that goddamn shit, the, the, the U.N. troops, they calling for the U.N. troops to go to Chicago, man. All right? Yeah, you, you, you got to... That's a, 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 a prime indication that we in the end, man. All right? That's a prime example of what time that we living in. That's why the scriptures say you pay attention to the, the, the times of the times. And when the things pass, which I told you before, man. All right? Then shalt thou know that it is, you know what I'm saying, the time... You know, roughly paraphrase, I believe that was that. Uh, uh, second verse, the ninth chapter. Yes. Yeah. Uh-huh. Come, go ahead. I, verse 12. And they shall wander from sea to sea. Yep, yep. Hey, yeah, because it's like it. Everybody going to be looking for us, man. All right? Because it, 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 it's going to be martial law here in these streets, man. Yep. From the west side of town, you know, the motherfuckers might even see us in the world and shit, man. Oh, yeah. You know, oh, yeah, I see he be on the west side. They go to the west side. We ain't over there. We probably on the east side. We, we, we out in the suburbs, in the country somewhere. But they're going to be searching for us, man. This. And they shall wander from sea to sea, mm -hmm. and from the north even to the east. Yeah, because they're going to be thirsty, man. See, you could go uh, uh, a long time, I believe it's 30 days or, or more without food, man. But you can't go that long without water. And this water, you, you people ain't going to last without this, man. Especially Jake's, man. You, you Negroes and, you know, you people of Negro and Indian descent. You're already going to die of thirst, man. At the end of the day, that's what y'all gonna die of, man. Fucking thirst. Yeah, go so, ahead. Real quick. This, All right. Yeah, okay. Yeah. All right, St. John 7 and 38. Mm -hmm. He that believeth on me, as the scriptures have said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. All right? All right, because, um, you know, that we're the ones who are, um, we're, we're the ones who, who teach Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, all right, according to the volume of the book. All right, you know, so we're the ones who have that, um, who have that living water. Mm -hmm. That life. Yep. We get cause we giving life, man. We the ones who giving life into the earth, man, by coming out here pushing the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah and coming in that same spirit, man. We giving life into the earth, man. That's why the earth is gonna start back to replenish itself when we come into power, man. Mm -hmm. You know? That's why the scripture says when the righteous is in when the wicked is in authority, the people mourn. The people, the place, the land, everything mourns when the wicked is in it, you know? But when the when the righteous bear rule, the people rejoice, man. Yep. The Jerusalem is a people before it's a place, but it's also a place too. So that means the land is gonna rejoice, you know. Yep, you got it. So I think some more in that ammo, some all that probably was it. But what you got? Go ahead, go ahead. Isaiah 55 and 6. Seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Yeah, because it's gonna, you're gonna, gonna come a time where the Lord, you're not gonna be able to find the Lord. And you can't find the Lord in these Christian churches. You can't find the Lord in the Baptist church, man. You can't find the Lord in the cathedral or synagogue or mosque, man, or a kingdom hall, man. You can't. The only place you can find the Lord is out here on the highways and byways where the, where the men of the Lord at, man. All right? Go ahead. Call upon him while he is near. Yeah, you got to call upon the Lord while he is near. The scripture tell you that uh, what people had the most high nigh unto them, man. You got to call unto the Lord while he is near, while he can hear you, man. He's in a vicinity where he can hear you. Huh. He about to walk, you know, we in the same room right now, so to speak, man. All right? He about to get up and, 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 and leave the living room, you know? He probably about to go upstairs to the master bedroom and chill out or some shit, man. Huh. <laughs> you know, he ain't going to be able to hear you niggas in a minute. Huh. Sound Let cool. the wicked forsake his way and the unrighteous man his thoughts. Yep. And let him return unto the Lord and he will have mercy upon him. And let our God, for he will abundantly part. Yeah, the Lord, he said he going to abundantly part. Because America about to be destroyed by missiles. 
Right. All right. right. Thermonuclear missiles, ICBM missiles. Google it. All right. Google it. <laughs> you know? You can some more on it. That's it. Yeah, man. Cause this place, man, this place is over, man. All right. This place is just over, man. Mm -hmm. Hey, I can't wait to see this place go down, man. You know? Get a uh, 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 song 58 or 10 right quick, Doc. You got some, you can get out there, whatever y'all got, man. Like, I want to say grab that revelation of the 20th chapter uh, yeah. when they talking about it and they seen the, uh, but I'll wait for that one, though. Yeah, I'll wait for it. Yeah. Come, come. That's, that's yeah, a good Psalms chapter. 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. Psalms, oh, he got, I got it. Right, Psalms 58 and 10. The righteous shall rejoice when he seeth the vengeance. Yeah, the righteous shall rejoice when he seeth the vengeance, man. All right? So the righteous is who, man? The elect, man, out of the nation of Israel. We're going to be rejoicing when we see the vengeance, man. All right? When we see the Lord finally take you heathens out of out of that power seat, man. All right? When he finally cut you, cut you asunder, man. All right? That's what we waiting on, man. Hey, the nigga woman, man, you goddamn women, man. You women ain't got no authority, man. Yeah. All right? Walking around here with your goddamn head up, man. Yeah. With your goddamn head up the so-called white man's ass, man. Like that nigga, uh, uh, my one nigga, man. Oh, uh, 8 Mile. You, you chasing future like he got carrots up his ass crack. <laughs> you know these motherfuckers chasing the soap. You got damn women, man. Hey, y'all women about to mourn, man. You got damn women got something coming, man. Cause you women are proud, man. Yeah. Here it is, a woman ain't got no, uh, uh, no, uh, testosterone, man. And she think that she can contend with a goddamn man. You got it. Yeah, the good part's coming up, too. Mm -hmm. All right, Psalm 58 and 10. The righteous shall re re rejoice when he seeth the vengeance. Yep. He shall wash his feet in the blood of the wicked. Mm. And that's what we gonna do, man. That's a metaphor. We ain't literally gonna get these goddamn heathens uh, blood on us, man. All right? You say there's more? So verse 11. So, so that a man shall say, verily, there is a reward for the righteous. Yeah, yeah, right. Hey, you need, hey, two-thirds is gonna be saying that, man. Truly, it is a reward for the righteous, because y'all going to see it too, man. Nope. Man, get Micah, man. Micah 7, chapter. Verily, he is a God that judges in the earth. Yep. The Lord, Yahweh Shimei was shot. That's when everybody going to know it, man. When they see when they see this place falling apart, when they see this economy, because we see it. It's, a, it's spiritually falling apart now, man. It's going to be it's gonna be physically manifested, though, man. All right? There ain't going to be no gas. ain't going to be no food in the grocery store, man. Everybody y'all here living it up and shit, man. Cause y'all got some kind. Y'all think y'all got this this false sense of a uh, 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 of free will, man, or or fucking liberty, man. You don't have no liberty in America, man. Especially if you're an Israelite, man. You don't have no liberty in this place, man. You on the bottom of the totem pole, man. You living in the most impoverished fucking communities, man. Huh. You know. What you got? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Go back to back, man. Oh, get uh seven and nine. No, get, go, go to 10. This is Micah, 7 and 10. Then she that is my enemy shall she. Yep. Hey, that's talking about men and now women, though, man. You, you, she, he, they, whoever, man. All right? Whoever, man. Whoever scoffed up against us, like the apostle said, niggas making your little stupid ass videos on the comment board, making your stupid ass, calling us dumb, calling us faggots, all right? Calling us uh, homos and all that shit, man. <laughs> calling us pedophiles, you know? Go ahead. Now you quit me in the spring, you on know, the comment board, make your stupid ass videos, man. <laughs> the fuck? No edification coming out whatsoever. Just scoffing, man, because you mad. You got the spirit of a woman on you. Like, um, like Yakana. It's like, um, like, um, like, like, ni like 90%, like, uh, over 90% of his, his videos are about, like, GMS. You know, if not that, you know, about, like, another camp. Or, you know, um, like, if there'd be, like, all, um, and it's funny, it's like, um, all right, and then there's, like, one video, all right, surrounded by, like, 20 other videos talking shit about us. Like, this is, like, one video of edification on the Northern Kingdom. All right, shit like that. All right, but they spend like the ma majority of their time, you know, against us. Mm -hmm. Watching our videos and shit, <laughs> C critiquing our video down to the minutest, you know. We're trying to catch it. They did the same thing to Yahusha, man. Trying to catch him in his words and shit. If he slip with a tongue or something like that, man, you know. But what he did, he stayed spiritual, man. He stayed spiritual, man. 
All right. Hey man, get uh, like, go get some destruction scripture, man. This is destruction, man. This place, man. Get up, ready, uh, Isaiah, look, bro, Jeremiah, or Second Peter. Yeah, come. Yeah. Part three and three. Yep. Knowing this first, or that it, that there shall come in the last days scoffers, walking yeah, after their own lusts. Or and saying, where is the promise of his coming? Yeah, well, cause that's what all these people do. They just they walk after the lust of their own hearts. You know, the things that they covet, co covet, covet over, man. Mm -hmm. The things that is, that's pleasurable to them, man. That's what they do, and that's what these scoffers doing that shit. Like the brother made mention of earlier, man. It is a sport for a fool to do mischief. It's a, it's fun to them. Because Jake, when they're in the sports, man, that shit is fun to them. That's why they do that shit from when they fucking two years old. They get into uh, sports, you know. They become a part of a team. They better play baseball, softball, t-ball, all that shit, man. You know, because it's fun. And it's fun to these scoffers to do the shit that they be doing. All right, verse 5. Actually, I want to, um, I'm going to skip you down. Gotta, so I'm going to get to that, um, you know, second I want to get to that good part. All right, um. Right, Second Peter three and ten. Yep. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night. Yeah, the day of the Lord gonna come as a thief in the night, meaning it's gonna catch a lot of people off guard, man. Like when a so-called white man service high risk warrants at four o'clock in the morning before the sun has come up. That's how the Lord is gonna catch a lot of people off guard. All right. That's how you coming as a thief in the night, because the majority of people gonna be asleep, resting, you know, laid up. It's gonna be like a movie montage with all these like wicked motherfuckers getting oh, rounded up. Oh, <laughs> uh, you know what I'm talking like oh uh, like oh uh, you know, to be like oh uh, let's say he's getting like a lap dance or something then like can't yeah, yeah. Or did you get the <laughs> shit like that? You got some music in the back. Slam his head on the double board. But uh, all right, but the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in the which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise. And the elements shall melt with fervent heat. Yeah, from the ICBM missiles, man. All right? From the nuclear warheads, man. All right? From them, all the kilotons, man, that's going to be slamming into this goddamn place, man. All right? The earth also and the works that are therein shall be burned up. Yeah, because the works that are in this place is fucking wickedness, man. Everything that the so-called white man do is wicked. All right? Wickedness, man. Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, uh -huh. what men or persons ought ye to be in all holy conversation and godliness? Mm -hmm. Isaiah 66, oh, you got something else? Go ahead, you got it. Okay. So looking for and hasting mm -hmm. unto the coming of the day of the Most High. Yeah, looking for and hasting. When you go into that word hasting, I forget the Greek, but it meaning like, uh, 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 with urgency, man, urgent, urgent, you know what I'm saying, urgent. Uh, looking for and hasting under the coming of the day of the Most High, wherein the heavens being on fire shall be dissolved, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. Yep. All right, and all, I'm just going to get one more, verse for, for 13. So like that word hasting is the, the Greek is a spudu. It Who says, yeah, yeah. It says mean, it meaning to desire earnestly. You're supposed to desire the day of the Lord earnestly. Man. Where that word like speed comes from. Come. Come. You're supposed to sincerely desire the day of the Lord, man. All right? Because when the day of the Lord is at hand, the, the, when that happened, man, we it's, we out of here, man. You know, the people that's on this sign right here, man. You got it, huh? Nevertheless, we, according to his promise, Look for new heavens and a new earth. Yeah, because that's what we're looking for. We're looking for a new rulership, man. All right? Which is going to be on which is gonna be on the earth. The earth is going to be made, uh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to grow. It's going to increase, man. That's what we're looking forward to. Here's the patience of faith for the saints, man. Wherein dwell righteousness. Wherein dwell of righteousness, the kingdom of heaven. Because everything in the kingdom of heaven is going to be righteous. Whether we bash the goddamn Edomite baby head open. You know, or, or you know, throw 10,000 Edomites off a cliff. It's going to, everything in the kingdom that's going to be done is going to be righteous, man. All right? 
It's gonna be wickedness, but we gonna that shit is gonna be corralled up, man. All right, we gonna have that. We gonna have a the, 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 uh, the, we gonna have the reins on wickedness, man. You know, it ain't gonna abound in the kingdom, man. It ain't gonna overflow. It over.